those rumors. With the second pick in the draft, the Houston Texans select C.J. Stroud. The two-time Heisman finalist led a high-powered Ohio State offense for the last two seasons, racking up a Big Ten record, 85 passing touchdowns over that span. Reports of low cognition scores on that test did give some pause, but not the Texans. Stroud becomes the first Big Ten QB selected in the top ten since Kerry Collins in 1995. Back in studio with the guys, we're going to turn to our guy Pete Prisco for a grade first and foremost. Pete, C.J. Stroud at number two. We were led to believe maybe that would not be the case because of that cognition test. What do you make of the pick? Yeah, look, I'm, I give the Texans a lot of credit. You have to take a swing for a quarterback. If you feel you don't have one, draft one. You have to try and fix it. I like the move. I like C.J. Stroud. I don't believe uh, in a lot of those testing numbers. I think he plays smart. I give him a B. Just because they took the shot at the quarterback, they almost didn't from what we heard. It's a smart move. Draft the quarterback. All right, thank you, Pete. The hand was forced. The pick is in. Ryan Wilson, Brian McFadden here to react. C.J. Stroud at two. Last 48 hours or so have probably been tough for this young man, Ryan. Mm -hmm. uh, been hearing a lot about his ability off the field, but we know what he is on the field. How does he project here as a Houston Texan? This makes all the sense in the world. Uh, on Monday, uh, you had your BMAC mock draft 1.0 come out. I had my what team should do mock draft come out, and I said <laughs> the Houston Texans should take C.J. Stroud and not overthink it. We heard conversations about maybe it's Will uh, Anderson. Yep. Great football player. He doesn't throw touchdown passes, and you need a quarterback, and C.J. Stroud checks all the boxes, and you just go back to his last college football game, BMAC, mm. against Georgia. Yep. Can he run? Hey, it turns out he can run and win with his legs as well. He's incredibly accurate, arguably the most accurate passer in this class, and that includes Bryce Young. He doesn't throw with the anticipation as Bryce Young, but mm -hmm. he also had Olave. Garrett Wilson, Marvin Harrison II, and those guys were always open. So I understand why there are questions about that part of his game. But from what I saw, no moment is too big. And when we met him in person, you got a sense in person the edge that he plays with and how he can lead his teammates. I think this is a great pick for Houston. Speaking of that edge, Ryan, we saw that on full display in the Peach Bowl against mm -hmm. Georgia. For the very first time in a long time, he was uncomfortable, to say the least. Right. You know, they made life miserable for him, especially in the second half, but he was able to gather himself right.